Hi everybody, it's Bobby Joe, and welcome to my home. I am coming to you with hashtag Tea Tuesday, which is hashtag probably Crystal Light with me. But um, yeah, so it is hosted by Life with Patty and Kathy's Favorite Things, and I will link them below. Um, so what have I been up to? I know I have been slagging on on YouTube. I have um, nothing that, you know, like, I find I want to do this stuff. I just don't have the energy for some reason to do what I need to do. So I'm giving myself time. So if I feel well enough to do a video, that's great. Um, and right now I am, and I'm always happy to interact with you guys. So yeah, it's it's something that I, I'm working through, but I do miss you guys when I'm not on. And I am watching videos. I'm just not doing a lot of comments. So I have to get on that um, for sure. But uh, yeah, so what's going on with me? Well, my father and I are working on his lifesaver um, for the boat. I needed to pick up some black vinyl for him. I mean, I, for him because I did not have enough. Now I'll get to hashtag smash my craft room in a moment here. But anyways, um, so I did go and purchase some more vinyl for him. Um, this one is according to Amazon two, three years and UV protected and water resistant. So for Cricut and it's 12 by 48, I think it is. Let me see. Yeah, 12 by 48. Cricut, $10. 10. I would never be able to get that for 10 at Michael's. $10 on Amazon. I couldn't believe it. Um, I thought about buying more and then I said, no, smash my craft room. And also I was worried that it may go, may, may lose the stickiness or something. So I um, just stuck with the one. That should be good enough to do our project. It's just a matter of getting his um, boat name on to the life preserver. And um, yeah, so, it, and I did another couple of things for him for uh, the W, he needed a WC34 thing um, for his boat, a couple of those. So I already cut those out in gold and stuff like this. And, so my father's boat, I got to see it last week for the first time. He's had it for like two years almost now. But anyways, I got to, to St. John the, uh, the last week and I was ecstatic because mom and dad were there and I was able to hang out with both of them. Uh, both of them. Um, so yeah, I really enjoyed myself played trip with my mother. I think she kicked my butt. Um, she was getting, yeah, her hands were crazy. So, um, I ate well because she made me stuff and gotta love mom stuff, you know? Anyways, so, um, I got to see it. It is beautiful. I loved it. I could so see myself living in something like that. Um, most people wouldn't like like living in something so small, but I I have no problem living in a very small space. My I, my apartment is large right now, but I I've had small apartments and it doesn't bother me in the least. So this one here, this boat is oh, I love it. It's got um, they like it's they've got a. Uh, chair and a couch in there and uh, stuff like this so you could just hang out in the uh, that then you go downstairs my father's done a lot of work downstairs um, and uh, it's gorgeous I love it and then he just put a solar panel on the top um, so yeah he's pretty pumped and I'm pumped for him because he he oh he loves his boat so, well, both of them do actually. So anyways, um, hashtag smash my craft room doing well on it. I did, I did do the vinyl thing. The reason I did the vinyl thing is because he needs it for his boat. 
and it's his birthday present, basically. Um, so anyways, doing well, except I, I did lose, because I have three option, uh, optional items, I did lose two so far. And yeah, the one that I did was I ordered two um, uh, die sets that were the same as a Sizzix or something like this. Um, so I got a really, really good deal on them. And I picked up a couple of those um, for myself and a friend. So um, just waiting for those to come in and then I'll show you guys. And otherwise, I've just been working on things. So if you don't know what the hashtag Smash My Craft Room is, um, it's not a no spend for me. It's a go to, to do as many projects as I can with the stuff I already have in my craft room. This does not include glue. It doesn't include tape, for instance, but all the other things, my dies, my stamps, my papers, my embellishments, my, <laughs> um, my, yeah, I have way too much stuff. So I was getting overwhelmed. I gave, um, I did a big purge and gave it and some to a friend of mine and I'm feeling less overwhelmed. And what I'm doing lately is taking dyes that I haven't really used a lot out of my, um, out of my bunch and doing a bunch of embellishments with them. So I have been working on little purses. I will show at a, uh, with uh, on another video. And I have my hashtag Christmas365 done as well. So it's hard not to buy anything. anything. It's really hard. Um, you, want, you want everything? It's just... I've told myself I was going to do this journey and I'm doing this journey whether I like it or not um but I'm enjoying it because I'm getting scraps taken care of I have so many scraps it's unreal so I'm using a lot of them um I'm using um cut aparts using embellishments that I've had sitting and sitting and sitting and I just didn't want to get rid of I just uh, because I love them but um yeah so this uh, this is if you want to join along please feel free to use the hashtag hashtag smash my craft room but basically what it is is you don't buy any, anything until you can't make another project that might be in a month might be in six months I don't know how long it's gonna go I don't know how long I can keep it up because it's hard. Um, but it's making me think outside my comfort zone and that's what I want to do. So bringing back my creativity a little bit instead of just collecting, I am using, which makes me happy. So that's the update for that. Um, Hmm. Cutting out a lot of embellishments as well to give to people. I've got um, Happy Mail going out to a couple of people now. Um, I just, oh, I finished the, I had that Alice in Wonderland um, album um, on the go for months. And I finally finished that. That's going out to a friend um, who was interested in it. And um, what else? I, and I did use a lot um, of items in that that I had collected for Alice in Wonderland. And I think I might do another one. I think I have enough to do another one. Um, so, but I don't want to do it just right now. Um, I would prefer right now to try and, and try and just work through some of the stuff that I have in my craft room. I do want to eventually do a classic Winnie the Pooh one um, that will come, I hope, when hashtag smash my craft room is 
a little bit <laughs> a little bit further along um i i decided that i'm going to do something with i have a mat that i go that goes over my tiles where my, so my 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 chair can roll easily um that i cleaned today and i noticed that there's like some of the green that um I might have spilt some of the green uh, chalk paint that I used for a couple of things in my craft room. And I like how it, the image in my mind is to paint the mat. So you guys tell me whether or not I should, I don't know. I think it would look cool having the green mat. Um, and what I plan on doing, not the one that, not the, I'm doing, I mean the underside, not the one that my chair rolls on, not the side, the other side, um, paint it green and then a see through C so the green will come through, but let me know what you guys think of that. Otherwise I am preparing, um, for an overall, not a craft room tour, but an overall view of what my craft room looks like. I, uh, I have a couple of people that are interested in that. So I figured I could just give a quick overview and eventually when I get more organized, um, I'm pretty organized, but I, I'm, I'm just finishing up a few things and then I'll go through it in detail. But I figured, you know, you guys only see a certain section and a lot of people don't realize how small this place is. <laughs> Everybody thinks it's bigger than it is. It is but the room itself is huge um but mario's got half of it so um it's it's a small craft room so i have like um seven or eight tiles 12 by 12 tiles that go this way so yeah that, i've got seven or eight um feet to deal with that way and then i've got like 12 the other way so anyways I will do it up so you guys can see it. I'm doing um, a massive clean underneath my desk for the uh, for spring cleaning. Um, and yes, yeah, so stay tuned for hashtag th Christmas365, posting that uh, as well. Um, and yes, yeah, so I'm happy to see you guys. And thank you very much for those who are with me. And um, I will see you guys another time. Bye.